Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Oi, Firecracker. Come here. So, have you heard the news? The news about the Spring Festival. Yeah, they had to, um... They had to back it up because of the uh, prison outbreaks and whatnot around the city. Yeah, sadly it's getting pushed back, but, yes, there is a but to that sentence. I, um, well, come walk with me for a second. All right. So, yeah, the spring festival, it's pushed back like a week or two because of the outbreaks and, um, well, it's our duty to set up for the uh, festival. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're gonna help, don't worry. We have lots of help going around. Especially with Ida on our team. He's not gonna let us have any type of break. Yeah, I know that's how he is, but it's annoying. And you know how easily I get annoyed. Anyway, well, besides that, with all the decoration and whatnot, and when that's done, I was, uh, I was wondering, I was wondering if you could, um, maybe come with me to the Sprig Festival when it's all said and done. Yeah, of course. Afterwards, like, we can go get something to do, because obviously that festival is probably going to be boring. Well, besides the food and everything, there's nearly nothing there. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's supposed to celebrate spring and what it has to bring and the day of growth. I get it, I get it. Blah, blah, blah. But listen, sometimes festivals can get boring like that. It's all formal. And it's just not my style. Well, it's just, like I said, it's just not my style. So I'm asking if you want to go because I know you like that sort of stuff. And, well, afterwards I can go... I don't know, maybe dinner or a movie, something like that. Yeah, hero duty? Uh, doing what, if you don't mind me asking? Really? Oh, yeah, I won't. I won't blurt it out. But, uh, has Hawks really trust you? With being a spy already? I mean, it's your first time being a hero. I mean, it's not really gonna... It's not really a good thing to be a spy first thing. You can get yourself in a lot of trouble and also getting yourself hurt. You sure you're capable of doing something like that? I'm not saying that you're not capable of doing something like that, but I'm just worried, that's all. Yori, oh, well, well, let me shut my mouth then. You need a drink? I got one. No, oh, okay. Well, besides that, how is hero work? 
Yeah, I would assume so, but yeah, I'm glad it's going good for you. Me? Oh, I've been... I've been all over the city catching uh, lowlifes and criminals and straight-up disgusting people. Yeah, let me tell you about this one criminal that I fought. He had like a nasty tongue quirk. It was kind of like Froppy's, except way grosser. He had like mucus all over, it was disgusting. Yeah, and afterwards when he got caught, and I tangled him up in his own tongue, it was funny. <laughs> uh, we had to clean up his snot rockets and drool everywhere. It was gross, it took us about 40 minutes before that whole place was cleaned out. Yeah, we had to get a whole team and suits and whatever, it was gross. Yeah. And I think, um, what else? What else was there? There was a guy with an elephant quirk, but, uh, he was kind of easy. You know how, you know the saying, the bigger they are, the harder they fall? Yeah, well, took that saying quite literally, and he fell with a great fall. <laughs> yeah. Eh, nothing really much afterwards, that. Um, afterwards, me and Kirishima, and I think Saro and Mina, we went over to just a local food stand, and we got some stuff to, like, you know, eat. I think it was takoyaki balls. I, I, I can't remember. It was, like, yesterday or something like that. I... While ago, all right. <laughs> well, I mean, if you're not busy doing your hero work, and I mean, sure, we can bring you along next time. You know, j patrol duty and whatnot. Yeah, of course. We're just gonna have to tell Hawks and whoever you're f with on that day. Oh, yeah, definitely, definitely. Yeah, what's up, Firecracker? I think I told you before about why I call you that. Yeah, um, well, basically, well, I can tell you again. Yeah, so, I think it was, like, the first time we met back in the UA building. Not the first time we met, but like a few times, and I usually give everyone a nickname that makes me remember people easier. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <sighs> Excuse me. <clears throat> so yeah, I started calling you Firecracker because you blew up on, I think, who was it? It was either Denki or Mineta. And I liked how you were popping off on them, so I called you Firecracker. Because your attitude back when. And now that I see you're more of a sweet, innocent type of person, it, I mean, it just kind of stuck, really. Yeah. And something easier to have in my mind to remind me of you. Yeah. Yeah, it's a memory thing. That's what it is. All right, cool. Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, about that. I think, um, either Denki or... Sarah wanted to talk to you. Yeah, it was, um... They wanted to just talk, just catch up. Because you guys haven't seen each other in a little bit. Yeah, nothing serious, no. Just to, ca just to catch up with you. Yeah. You know, I know everyone's, like, busy with hero work nowadays, but, like, some days you just gotta catch up with your friends and whatnot. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. But uh, besides that, do you want to go to the spring festival with me? All right, cool. Uh, I don't think we have you have to wear any type of kimonos or anything like that. It's not really like a formal thing. Yeah, you can wear your hero's outfit and stuff. All right, cool. I'll see you in a week or so. You want me to pick you up at like 9, 10 ish? Yeah, all right. And afterwards, you could probably go over to the bar or something, have a few drinks. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds cool. All right. Take it easy, firecracker. <laughs>